As the weather cools off, more and more cases of the sniffles start popping up around the office. So what are some things to keep in mind during flu season? Joining us to talk about that is Director of Operations for Healthcare Partners, Joseph Thrower. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having me today. All right, so it's on everybody's mind. You know, you see people go, you're six day away from me. People think that other people just have the plague. They don't want to come down with it, but it is that time of year. It is. First and foremost, what should people do? Well, the first thing, first and foremost, definitely get your flu shot. You want to protect yourself and others that you come in contact with. We recommend that six months and older, um, you get the flu shot every year. And the flu's available, the, the shot's available now, so you can get it right now. There are even clinics you can drive on through. They make it easy. You stick your arm out. Mm -hmm. yep. I've never tried that before, but in this busy lifestyle, hey, there's something for everyone, isn't there? Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. And it's available at all of our locations right now, and all of our patients can just walk right in and get it. That's fantastic. Now, I know we were discussing a little bit earlier, I was asking about the effectiveness because there were some issues last season where it wasn't as effective. So we're seeing this year that we're, we're keeping our fingers crossed that this particular, the strains that are in the flu, there's about three to four strains in the, okay. uh, in the shot. We're keeping our fingers crossed that it is pretty effective this year. So we're not that deep in the flu season right now to kind of um, gauge the, the effectiveness, but it's looking pretty good. And in fact, flu season goes all the way until, what is it, February, March? It's pretty long, isn't it? Mm -hmm, until about the end of March. Jeez Louise. So mm -hmm. there's no bad, it's good to get prepared now, but would you suggest, let's say someone just waits a little bit longer, they're lucky enough to make it through without it, it's never too late to get one, is it? Well, it's not, it's not. But the, the sooner you get it, the better you are to protect yourself and others. Definitely. Mm -hmm. Okay. Anything else you'd like to share with our viewers? Um, just you know, if uh, if anyone's interested in you know s uh, seeing a healthcare partners provider, yeah. this is a great time for Medicare open enrollment. Um, nice. It goes through December seventh. Okay. And uh, this is a great time to review your primary care uh, provider, your Medicare Advantage plans, and we have events throughout the community where you can talk to a provider or figure out some of the services that healthcare partners offers. Sure. All right. Thank you so much. We appreciate you coming Thank in. Thank you. All right, we'll be right back.